Hello siblings and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a little bit of a day in my life. And this is gonna be like a real raw day in my life. So far all my videos I've been pretty positive and stuff, but honestly guys, the last few days have been rough for me. I have been struggling, uh, you know, just like laying in bed, crying, that kind of vibe. Not having a good time over here. And I'm trying to stay positive, but it's not always easy. And I want to show you guys just like, you know, the real raw things aren't always easy. Um, I've kind of been struggling to find motivation to like film and stuff. So I have the motivation today to do it like a day in my life. So <laughs> we're going to vibe with it. Right now, uh, it's Sunday and I am getting ready for church. And I'm just going to do like a little bit of makeup. I have on a cute little outfit and... Then we'll get going. And then let's see what the temperature is today. It's like 60s, so maybe I could like go to a park. I don't know, we'll see. So while I get ready, I wanna to talk to you guys about today's sponsor, which is Audible. I'm gonna be listening to Audible while I get ready. Audible is a great option for people like me who don't have the time or don't like to read. You can just listen to audiobooks. I'm currently listening to the audiobook, The Art of Not Giving an F. It's like a motivational book and I really like it so far. If you didn't know, Audible has thousands of titles to choose from, including audiobooks, podcasts, guided wellness programs, comedy, and Audible originals that you wouldn't find anywhere else. I love Audible because I can listen anytime, like while I'm getting ready or in the car or cleaning the house. If you guys sign up for Audible Plus, you can listen and find new favorite titles and explore tons of different formats that you might have not considered before. All new members can always try Audible Plus for free for 30 days. Just download the app and sign up. You can visit audible.com slash sydney or text sydney to 500-500. That's audible.com slash sydney or text sydney, s-y-d-n-e-y, to 500-500. Okay, I'm ready. And here's today's fit. I love the matching white, white socks, black boots, black dress. Such a vibe. This dress, I get a bunch of questions about. It's from Dolls Kill. The shirt is American Eagle and these are Doc Martens. And that's my leftover pizza from last night. <laughs> So I just remembered that Sonic has pretzels and they're so good. So I'm getting a pretzel and an ocean water at Sonic and then I'm also going to Taco Bell. I guess I'm just like treating myself for no reason today. Um, do I deserve it? Probably not. Um, it's fine. All right, I always get an ocean water. Oh my gosh, it's different. Also, life hack, always order on the app because it's always happy hour on the app. Okay, pretzel time. Let's take a little bite. Mmm. I never really thought about it before, but I think pretzels might be one of my favorite foods. Like, any opportunity I have to get a pretzel, I'm down for. Can't wait to dip it in the cheese sauce. Okay, let's go get my Taco Bell order. I won't really just eat this whole pretzel right now, but I want to wait till I'm home and I can, like, sit down and really enjoy it, you know? Now in the Taco Bell drive-thru. Whoa, this ocean water tastes really weird. It's, like, really sugary. Do they always taste like this? I don't know. I'm also very hungry. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm so tired of driving. I wish I had someone to drive me around everywhere. Hi, I have a mobile order for Sydney. It is 60 degrees outside, so it's like decently nice, but I just wanna go lay in bed and watch Netflix. Just one of those days, you know? It's been one of those days, actually, every day. Okay, I got both my foods, and now I'm gonna go vibe and eat it. I'm so hungry. Sorry, I'm like struggling to talk to the camera because I'm just struggling to form thoughts. I finished all my food. Now I'm at the part of the Sonic thing where you just, you know, eat all the ice. And if I'm being honest, I am currently on the verge of trying to not cry. So it's not going great. Um, Sonic ice, yay! I'm gonna go change into some comfy clothes. So the not crying thing is not going great. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm gonna put on some sweatpants and maybe go pee. I don't want you guys to like worry. I'm fine. It's just that um, it's just been a rough few days and I've had to take off my spandex. And I don't want you guys to think that I am just like perfectly fine all the time because you know, oh, why are my pants wet? Please, of course my cats. 
peed on my sweatpants. What else did they pee on? Okay. Ace, you know mommy loves you. Why do you have to pee on everything? Also, my drawer broke, so that's great. Ace, mom needs love. Can you come here? Oh, so cute. Oh gosh. <laughs> um, I my eyes are not bleeding. My mascara is maroon. I put on these sweatpants and I just have the shirt on I was wearing. I think I'm gonna watch some Netflix. Okay, it's been a little bit. I'm feeling much better. So I'm gonna clean up my makeup. I've just been vibing with it like this. And I wanna talk to you guys about something. We'll talk in the animal room. I never come in here. So I know I just did a Q&A and talked about this and I've talked about it like a million times on this channel, on Instagram, on TikTok, all of that. But I have been struggling the last little bit because I am in the same apartment that I lived in with my ex and it just is not healthy for me. Like I wake up, I'm like, oh, we used to sleep here. We used to sit here. We used to, you know, all that. And I don't know if I can stay here until October. On top of that, like everywhere around where I live reminds me of my relationship and it's not fun. It's not a good time. So I've been thinking about moving. Um, I was looking at apartments and I'm thinking about literally just like selling everything except like the stuff I really need, like I'll keep my cat wheel, things like that. But literally like sell my bed, sell my couch, sell everything I can, <laughs> move very minimally and just start fresh somewhere. I know that's crazy to say, but I think I'm gonna do it. I don't know. So part of me has been thinking about texting my landlord, seeing what the situation would be like with the lease and moving like end of June or beginning of July, something like that. Cause I just cannot, I can't be here anymore. I really can't. So yeah, I guess I just want to keep you guys updated. That's been on my mind. I'm gonna start listing all my stuff on Facebook cause whether or not I move, I just am tired of having so much stuff. <laughs> I decided to try to make myself feel better. I'm going to take a long shower and I'm going to like wash my hair, shave my legs, the whole shebang. So let's prepare for that. First turn the shower on to get it heating up. So first I'm going to brush out my hair. So I've been using the Olaplex system. So before I get in the shower, I do Olaplex number zero and number three in my hair. You know, just trying to keep my hair nice and healthy. And I do this like once a week. And just in case anyone's wondering, you're probably not, but I also use the Olaplex shampoo and conditioner. I shampoo my hair once a week when I do all this and I condition twice a week. And then on the blonde parts of my hair, I use the Kerastase purple shampoo. I think that's how you say it. So I do wash my black and blonde Separately, speaking of, it's like here's what my blonde looks like right now. Um, up here, it's like not the greatest color, it's pretty brassy because it wouldn't lift when I dyed it. But I have a touch up appointment like the first week of May, so I'll be uh fixing my hair then. Okay, I'm gonna go get naked and get in the shower, so I will see you guys after. And I'm out of the shower. Got a nice little low bun I'm rocking here. Um, I'm in my PJs. I just realized the only thing I've eaten today was all that food. So I think I'm gonna like eat something. I'm not very hungry though. I need to drink more water. That's what I need. My nutritious meal for dinner. Leftover pizza. Ace, you want some? Here you go. And a paper plate, cause I need to do the dishes. <laughs> and my dirty microwave. And a side of pickles. My dinner of champions. Oh, making a mess in my bed. And then I have to sleep in my crumbs. Mmm, <laughs> good though. Well, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed kind of seeing like a real raw day in my life. One of the days that isn't quite as good. And yeah, I'm still vibing, still surviving. Just have rough days here and there, just like everyone. So thought I'd show you the ups and the downs. <laughs> Once again, thank you to Audible for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.